iPhone 7 Plus. This is coming out in September, September 16th. So what's new in these phones? We've been expecting some iterations, maybe water resistance. Well, that's here, IP67, and it's also got new color. This is black. There's also jet black, which is glossy. This is just black black. Uh, and there are dual cameras. That's what makes the Plus a step up from the 7 this year. The dual cameras are both 12 megapixel, and they can enable depth of field to do something that's in, in cameras called bokeh that allows um, like a soft focus effect. And there's also zoom. You can actually take photos on this and snap from 1x to 2x, and then go all the way up to 10x with software. And even though that software zoom, Apple says that the quality of that is going to be a lot better than you got on previous iPhones. So that's a big difference. There's also some other tweaks across the iPhone line. That home button is no longer a clickable one. It's solid state. So it feels like those force touch trackpads on the MacBook. You press and hold to control it. There's also no headphone jack, as we knew. This has stereo speakers now, and if you want to connect headphones, you can use an included lightning adapter in the box or use lightning connected ear pods or use AirPods, which are coming out in October. These are wireless. They automatically pair with the iPhone, and you can pop these out, put them on, connect them instantly, and enjoy higher fidelity audio, according to Apple, with uh, five hours of use. So maybe you switch to wireless, maybe you use an adapter. That's what the iPhone has in a nutshell. Did I mention battery life? The new processors on both of these are not only faster and more graphically capable, but they're going to be more power efficient. They're going to switch down and allow more hours of use. So both of these should expect at least several hours more battery life, which is exciting to me. That plus water resistance, I could drop it in the pool and still be able to use it for a longer period of time. More to come as we test these. I'm Scott Stein here in San Francisco with the iPhone 7 Plus.